Hi, it's Naomi from TaskTop. Today I'm going to be demonstrating how TaskTop Hub integrates Jira Align with the rest of the software delivery tool chain to improve the speed, velocity, and quality of your deliveries. TaskTop automates the flow of work across tools and between IT practitioners to eliminate duplicate data entry, human error, and administrative overhead. Jira Align is an enterprise agile planning tool increasingly popular in large enterprises. Ideas that start in Jira Align are executed in work management tools like Jira, Azure DevOps, and Rally, tested in tools like Tosca, QTest, ALM, and SmartBear, and supported in ITSM tools like Jira Service Desk, ServiceNow, and Remedy. In this demo, we'll see how TaskTop Hub reliably and seamlessly performs bi-directional synchronization between Jira Align and other tools, eliminating friction and delays, and normalizing the data as it flows through a model. We'll see how Hub elegantly merges several acceptance criteria from Jira Align into a single rich text formatted field in a targeted tool. We'll see how we automate artifact creation in Jira Align based on activities in other tools like Salesforce. We'll see how we automate traceability by inserting back references and links to twinned artifacts in other tools. And we'll see the intuitive admin user interface where all the integrations are set up and administered. So in the demo I'm about to show you, we're going to look at the end-to-end -end value stream for a fictional company that develops online conferencing software. When an analyst creates a case in Salesforce, TaskTop will flow the case over to Jira Align as a capability under a specific epic. When two features are created for the capability, TaskTop flows each one to the appropriate development team and tool, one going to Jira and the other to Rally. TaskTop flows both features to Tasca as well, so the testing team can start designing tests based on the feature acceptance criteria. And finally, we'll see how as the developers break down the features into stories, TaskTop flows the stories and their progress back to Jira Align. So let's get started. Starting in Salesforce, a business analyst creates a new case. In the description, she describes a request for improved collaboration capabilities that multiple participants be able to share their screens simultaneously. She enters a description and clicks Save to create the case. Switching over to Jira Align, a quick refresh reveals that the case has flowed over as a new capability. By the way, you can configure these relationships between artifacts to suit your own specific use case. Clicking into the capability, you can see that the name and description have flowed over. The description includes a link to the related, or as we call it, twinned Salesforce case. And the primary program and parent epic have both been assigned based on the integration's configuration and the artifact fields. We assign the capability two additional programs, meeting host and meeting participant. Let's close this capability and proceed to create some child features. The first feature is about the host controls for multi-share. In our demo scenario, the team or value stream that develops meeting host features works in Jira. So that's where we want this feature to be routed to eventually. The routing is going to be based on the primary program field. We set the primary program to meeting host. Next, we set the parent capability and choose the release vehicle. After a quick save, we add in the acceptance criteria. In Jira Align, each acceptance criterion is in a separate field, and we're going to add three of them. Next, we move the feature to ready to start and click save and close. Now let's move on to creating a second feature, this one for the participant elements of the feature. We're going to set the primary program to meeting participant, which will route this feature to a different development team that works in Rally. And as before, we'll set the capability, release vehicle, and create multiple acceptance criteria. We set the feature to ready to start and save. Over in Jira, let's see what happened. Here we have the meeting host feature, which has flowed over as an epic. Again, those artifact relationships are completely configurable. In the description, you can see three things. 
First, you have the description that was entered in JIRA Align. Then you have the three acceptance criteria and their status. And finally, you have the link back to the twinned artifact in JIRA Align for easy navigation and communication with colleagues who work primarily in JIRA Align. So now we're going to change the status to in progress and begin story breakdown. We're going to create two stories. The first story is, as the meeting host, I have an advanced sharing options menu. We assign it to the parent epic and save. The second one is, as the meeting host, I can choose to enable, disable, multi-share at any time. Here too, we assign it to the parent epic and save. Let's just quickly go back to the epic and see that now it has these two stories. Cool, so let's switch over to Rally now. As you recall, the meeting participant feature has flowed over there. And very similar to what we saw in JIRA, the description, acceptance criteria, and link back to JIRA Align are all here in Rally. Here too, we're going to create two child stories. The first one says that as a participant using dual monitors, I can see the two most recently shared screens. It's associated with the parent feature, as you can see. And the second story says that as a participant using a single monitor or a mobile device, I can only see the most recently shared screen. It too is associated with the parent feature. So now we have two stories in Rally, plus the two stories in Jira. Now let's see how the progress of the story work is synchronized back to Jira Align. So returning to JIRA, let's go in and update the status of the two meeting host stories. Let's progress the advanced sharing options menu story all the way to done and set the enable disable multi-share to in progress. Switching over to JIRA Align, here's the meeting host feature. You can see it has two child stories and the status set in JIRA is visible here. One story is still in building, but the other is accepted. So now let's take a look at the synchronization between JIRA Align and a testing tool, in this case, Tricentis Tosca. Our goal here is to have the features flow over as requirements with the acceptance criteria, so test engineers have ample time to design good tests for them. And here indeed you can see the requirements coming in separately for the meeting host and the meeting participant. If we go into the host feature, here it is with a description and the three acceptance criteria. Just to wrap up the use case, once all the stories are done in their respective tools and testing has completed, the user in JIRA Align can change the feature status to accept it. That update will be reflected in the JIRA Epic for the benefit of the team there and in the Rally feature for the benefit of the team there. In summary, business and IT professionals across these five tools collaborated with each other seamlessly, never having to leave their tool of choice never having to copy and paste information, and never having to exchange over email. These sophisticated cross-tool use cases are brought to life through TaskTop Hub's clear and intuitive administration UI, one place from which to rule all your integrations. You can configure precisely what flows and how it flows with maximum reuse thanks to models, and you can easily monitor the activity of your integrations and view metrics on just how much manual effort you are saving your organization. If you like what you saw and you want to learn more, contact us today for a demo or evaluation at tasktop.com.